Hi everyone, this is Krista from Hilltop in the Valley and I wanted to share with you how I go about making my kids soft boiled eggs and then I use them for their meals in different ways. So I like to use a medium sized egg. Not only are these way cheaper at the grocery store, but my kids are more likely to eat all of the egg if it's a little bit more their size. I actually get these eggs down the road from a friend. Um, and hopefully soon we'll have our own chickens that will be laying our own eggs. But for that reason, for kids I like to use medium eggs. So I've got water on the stove. I have a two, actually this one's a three quart, a three quart pot. Um, and I filled it with enough water so that it will cover my five eggs by at least an inch of water when they're in the water. And they'll still, because there's only five of them in here, there's still gonna be some room in between the eggs so that the heat will be able to get through. You wanna make sure you've got a little bit of room in, in between your eggs when you're cooking them. Um, so right now, the water is on and I am cooking it and waiting for it to boil. Once it comes to a rolling boil, um, I'm gonna show you how I go ahead and put the eggs in and how long I cook them for. I am going to use a slotted spoon. Um, I've also used these um, spoons that you use for pasta. Those work great. Anything that has holes underneath that will let the water out are great to use. So let's put the eggs in. I have set the timer for six minutes, which is a little less time than your usual large eggs. Because you're not completely cooking it through like you would with a hard boiled egg, you're not denaturing all of the protein. And I find that I'm able to digest soft boiled eggs a lot more. Um, some of my kids actually like the fact that there is a little bit more softness inside. The timer is just about to go off. So when it goes off, I'm going to go ahead and take it off of the stove and bring it over to the sink and have cold water run over it until they cool off. Probably about five minutes, 10 minutes. So you're gonna want your eggs to sit under the cold water for a little while. Um, it just helps them to cool off and keeps them from continuing to cook. And once they get cooled off, you'll be able to store them in the fridge. Um, you can use them immediately if you want. They will be kind of soft when you're trying to take the shell off so they might um, break apart a little bit easier. But I'm gonna let these ones cool off and then I will come back and I will show you a few different ways that we like to use our soft boiled eggs. <laughs> 